EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to the heart of Texas and the very wonderful AT&T Stadium in Arlington. Obviously, they do everything big here in Dallas, and the introduction to the Cowboys, no exception. They're set for football in Big D as their guys will do battle with the Miami Dolphins. Here's Jason Sanders now to get this one started, and we are underway from AT&T Stadium. the first carry for Ezekiel Elliott. And he'll wind up with about six, up past the 30 to the 31. Ball carrier. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. Prescott. Got an open man, it's Michael Gallup. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. Well, remember, they tried to give him the ball and let him run on the last play, but I think the light bulb went off in their play caller's mind, and this time, they get it to him the more conventional way, and it's much more successful as well. First down run with Elliott, going to go for about four. Second and six coming up. Brandon, and all things considered, they have to feel pretty good about getting that type of a game, considering the blitz that they just had against them. from just shy of midfield, Prescott. And he's just going to get rid of this thing. To no one here, he throws it away. And now it's third. The good signal callers would never go back in the huddle and play the blame game because they need those guys to protect him. But on that last one, his offensive line, they lost their leverage very quickly. And that's why they were able to get to him and hit him as he tried to throw the football and force an incompletion. Escaping the pressure right. He can run for it, and he will. And he's got this down a yard or two shy of the 40 before he's out of bounds. Maybe not exactly what they had in mind, but that scramble good for six and a first down. 42-yard line. A first down carry by Allian. And he's able to carve out about six there, down to the 37. Ezekiel Elliott decided to hand it off that time on the run pass option. It appeared to be an easy decision. Just gave it inside. Nice steady gain. Second and four. Broad second down. It's Elliott. And he gets it down to the 32. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. At the 32 yard line. This is Elliott. And he'll go down at the 28. With the give, to they give him four yards there. It'll be second and six. Brandon, we just saw the benefits of being able to run the ball successfully. They pick up four yards on that carry. So now if you're a play caller, you can do just about anything you want. But on the defensive side of the ball, you scramble a little bit. Now you're behind trying to figure out, do I need to blitz him? Do I need to pressure him? How do I gain an advantage on this step? Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. Good job there to locate his tight end, Charles, in the middle of the field. Yeah, he has good pass-catching abilities, and if they're able to continue to find him here in the early going, I think it'll help out his teammates out on the perimeter. You can take the big shots later if he occupies their attention. Oh, it's incomplete. That would have been big in the end zone if he could have held on. Instead, it's second down. Here's Prescott. And this is caught. It's Cooper. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Dak Prescott hooking up with Amari Cooper. And the Cowboys take it all the way down the field and score on the opening drive. And his kick is no good. An inauspicious start here kicking-wise as this one stays a 6-0 game. So with the missed PAT in his rearview mirror, he goes back out to kick this one off. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. The Dolphins take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Two in the Dolphins now with a first and 10 at their 25-yard line. 
former Washington Husky. Here's Miles Gaskin. And he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. A loss of a yard on the play, and it's third down. Six nothing our score after one. With the score, Cowboys six, Dolphins nothing. And on third down, the Cowboys bring in an extra defensive back. Off a of play action, Tonga Bailoa. Oh, he got position on him, and he pulls it in. And he is going to have the Dolphins first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Dolphin first down. From the gun, it's Tua. And his throw here is incomplete. A lot of times it's that first read that you have. Maybe you get it in pre-snap. He locked in on his target, but he was covered quite well, and that one's incomplete. Back to the air on second down. Tongue of Iloa. Got a man, and he hits him in stride. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. 22 yards on the catch and run, a first down. And, the and this was a nice example of an offensive coordinator scheming his guy open. Just a little underneath route, just trying to free up some space. And it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch to pick up really nice yardage. They'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. This defense is really flown around in the first half. They've gotten to the ball carrier before they can really get started. Offense going to have to come up with something else in order to try and get this running game going. Tua wants to throw it on second down. He's airing it out for Williams. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Xavier, Xavier Woods with a pick. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. What a start defensively. Tua now on first down. Got a man over the middle. It's Williams. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Dolphins touchdown. Preston Williams on the throw from Tua. And the Dolphins have taken the lead. CD for them. This has just been an offensive explosion here in the second quarter. Yeah, held scoreless in the first quarter. Now they find the end zone again here in the second. Sometimes you just have to have some patience. A lot of people think it's always an adjustment. You have to change what you're doing. Sometimes you just have to do your game plan just a little bit better. And I think that's part of what we're seeing here. The Cowboys take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And from this spot in the field with the clock where it's at, you think we're just going to see a knee and that's it? And I think in this situation, that's the proper play. But we do know that that's caught inside the 20. And we're going to get a timeout with two seconds remaining in the second quarter. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. Final play of the half, Prescott. And that is caught. Touchdown, Cowboys. Dalton Schultz as time expires in the first half. And the Cowboys are an extra point away from tying the football game. Now Mike McCarthy saying let's go for two. Point conversion. 
They'll let Elliott try and run it in. And he will get into the end zone. So a perfect finish to the half. They get the touchdown on the final play. And two more for good measure. A good pickup there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Eight yards on the pickup. Brings up second and two at the 47. And again, it's Tunga Bailoa. Into double coverage, and it's intercepted. Play picked up by Trayvon Diggs. And they have the football that will set up shop at the 33-yard line. So Prescott of the Cowboys now with a first and 10 at the 33-yard line. He'll hand it off to Elliott to begin the drive. And he'll get this up to about the 40. For 21. It's a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. That's a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. They'll run on first down. It's Elliott, and able to push forward for right around three yards down to the 42. Well, that's just a pile of bodies there, and that's when you kind of find out who's a tough guy, right? Who can stand up and make a play? It was only a three-yard run, but for both sides, they had to walk away from that feeling like, okay, I can stand up when the going gets tough in here. On second and seven, Prescott. Give him three on the play, and that's going to bring up a third down. And that's a good job there by the corner. We do talk about this a lot, that a lot of corners see their job as simply covering receivers. Tackling isn't everyone's thing. But in this case, he came up quickly and made a nice, sure tackle. And he's able to get it to the 31, and that's enough for the first. Give him seven yards on the play as they do pick up the third down conversion. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. They'll try to throw now. Prescott. And it's caught inside the five. And he doesn't quite make it, taking it with it an eyelash. Dropped at the one. It'll go as an impressive 31-yard gain. And now before this first down play, we're going to get a timeout here. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. They'll try to run it in with Elliott, and he will take it in for a Cowboy score. They're punching it in from a yard away. And the Cowboys, they push out in front further. That almost looked too easy, and I think thanks goes to the offensive line for making it look easy. Yeah, I agree with you totally on that one. I'm not sure how much everyone understands the preparations that go into a game for an offensive line, because there's a reason that running backs and quarterbacks give them big gifts at the end of the season after a big year. The consistency and the continuity it takes to know each other and execute their blocks is pretty impressive. Oh, a good return up past the 30. Pass midfield. And he's got daylight. It's a foot race. Jakeem Grant. And they finally got to him at the two-yard line. 